Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Out on a Limb with Kim. Do I have a treat for you today? Good morning, everyone. Heather here from Heather's Hikes and Adventures. Let me show you my van. We're going to start with the back, or as I like to call it, my garage. Ignore the dust. All right, so this is where I keep my fridge, my collapsible sink. I have my car emergency kit with things like fix a flat, my tire inflator, my emergency battery jumper, and then under here, I've got my extra privacy panels for my clam shelter, which I'll show you in a little bit. I keep my back cushion just tucked back here out of the way, and that's where I store all of my towels, blankets, all that kind of extra bedding. Of course, you gotta have rain boots in Florida. And I've got my extra emergency food, pop-up storage tent in case I need a decoy tent or a little extra shade and then under here is my garage storage with things like bear spray extension cord hammock all that kind of fun stuff that I don't need very often got a toolkit over there and some mosquito netting because it's Florida all right let's check out the front space now all right, as you can see, I already have my mesh window screens on, which are key in Florida. They are so nice. As you can see, I'm able to roll my window down and it makes for good ventilation and airflow without the bugs. I keep my magnetic window curtain for privacy that I'll just put on right over top of it to the magnetic portion here. And then I've got some extra bug wipes, pepper spray, hand sanitizer, <laughs> lots of extra bug wipes, and then just some extra masks and hair clips. Nothing exciting up here. I do have an umbrella and a brush for sweeping. And then underneath my seat, I keep a little boot scraper so that if my hiking boots get really dirty, I don't track it into the rest of the van. I have my seat cushion for long trips, which is so much more comfortable for driving. And then I'm gonna walk around the other side. Hello! <laughs> All right, so I have my other magnetic curtain here for this window. Another umbrella, some windshield cleaner, which I never remember to use. I have a few of these little, um, charcoal dehumidifier bags that I'll just throw on the dash. This is my extra little solar lantern, which I hardly ever need to use. And then down here, I just keep my um, dry cooler, which is for all my snacks and stuff, my Jackery 240, all of my water storage, and then my emergency pop-up windshield cover when I'm not using the weather tech. All right, and then in the middle part here, I keep all of my um, just like tied stick, chapstick, things like that in there. And obviously I plug my chargers in. And here's where I keep all of my cords for charging that I need so that I don't have to hunt for them. Obviously I've got my glass case and some extra sunglasses. I love this cup holder inverter so that I can charge stuff while I'm driving. Of course, earbuds for editing. Just little things like that in here. I love this little cup holder uh, seat gap filler. So up here I always keep my headlamp so that I don't have to hunt for that. It's perfect for nighttime bathroom trips. I keep a spare hat carabiner here. And then I have two of these. Um, you can see the one on this side, I just keep my wet wipes in and um, some of those Loom deodorant wipes for after hikes. 
And then on this side, I have this nifty little carpet cleaner that I just got. Some sunblock, extra trash bags. I keep my extra slip-on shoes. Normally my shower sandals or camp sandals. And then um, you can kind of see all the stuff I mentioned there too. And I always keep a few extra microfiber towels for messes. I love this seat cover. I can tuck it out of the way when I'm not using it. And then when I'm driving, I can just cover up anything I don't want seen or don't want the sun to hit. Why, hello. <laughs> Welcome to my living space. So I always have my fan clamped here because I do like to be able to strategically place it wherever I want, but this is normally where it lives because I can aim it pretty much anywhere. And then this is essential. It's my pantry. It's my coffee station. It's got all of my utensils. I keep my coffee and food stuff here. Hot Logic, um, AeroPress. And then under here is like my shower wipes, my lighting, extra entertainment stuff, pretty much anything I might need easy access to while I'm inside my vehicle. It's not very organized right now, but gets the job done. I love my little rechargeable dehumidifier. Thank goodness it's on orange right now. It does take about six to eight hours to recharge, but in Florida it is essential. Um, really I haven't done anything to level the floor. I just have a bunch of washable rugs. <laughs> I've got my yoga cushion, which is my seating when I'm not in my bed, which is actually just my third row bench. I recently figured out that the back seats recline, <laughs> so it opens up the space a little more. And I should open up the back here to let a little light in so you guys can see better. <clears throat> I just got this fun little garland here that matches my bedding, so of course I had to have fun with that. And then these pillows are all empty pillowcases that I store pajamas, bedding, my sweats now that it's getting colder. I even have a little <laughs> snowsuit in here for, you know, the one day a year you might need it in Florida. <laughs> and then, um, my little co-pilot Smokey is hanging out next to my cup holder phone stand, which I found out is a flop up front because it does not stay in position, but it's perfect for watching TV on my phone at night. Heather, does your van have a name? It does. Her name is Tara, and she's a 2017 Dodge Grand Caravan. This is just another view um, of kind of my setup of my living area here. Obviously, I don't keep all of this up here when I'm driving. I just kind of stash it away. But this is my little mobile library, so I'll switch out my books. I always have my travel journal. I'm studying some hikes for the Smokies, which will hopefully be coming up soon. Um, my little DIY hack that I'm quite proud of. <laughs> I strung up my fairy lights and then I used the extra in this little mason jar to make a little lamp at night. Of course, I have my carbon monoxide detector, even though I'm too scared to cook with fuel. <laughs> and my fake candle. And then under here, I just keep this little lap desk and I can just kind of stash stuff underneath here to get it out of the way. And then I have my main power supply, which is my Jackery Explorer 1000, just nicely tucked under there for easy access. With this setup, I love how I don't have cords to trip over. I can just kind of tuck them right here out of the way. And then I can get to everything I need. And sometimes I'll bring my Jackery 240 up for like my phones and stuff like that. So I really love your setup. Do you have a... Um... A toilet how do you you know oh I did not even show you that I'm gonna walk around the other side okay so you can see it better I love your setup this is awesome Thank you so much. it's really cozy I really like how it's all open and I can just yes kind of 
walk through. Let me move my little vacuum out of the way. That's a neat vacuum too. So I, it's actually just a home vacuum, but I wow. just recharge it okay. before my trips because it holds a charge for days. So I just recharge it when I get back to home base. I normally keep this bungeed in place when I'm driving for obvious mm -hmm. reasons. <laughs> but this is my toilet. So it can collapse down into an ottoman. I'll just line it with bags. And then behind here, I have tucked in some cedar shavings and some like wipes and toilet paper and stuff back there. And I don't know if you can see it, but I'll keep some extra paper towels and Clorox wipes and stuff like that in there as nice. well. Now, Heather, do you have um, Instagram or YouTube? I do. I actually have two Instagrams. I have one for my YouTube channel, which is Heather's Hikes and Adventures. That's A D V A N. Yes. T U R E S. Adventures, because <laughs> I'm so clever. <laughs> That's awesome. I love it. And then my photography on Instagram is at Life in My Lens, but with a Z for lens cool. at the end. I'll put links below. Perfect. Thank so you. people can get a hold of you. Well, thank you so much for spending time with me and checking out my van today. Bye. See, See ya. See you later.